everybody, it's Steph. Okay, <clears throat> I have some awesome news. Uh, first of all, I'm feeling fantastic. Um, I love wigs, so <laughs> this is a wig. <laughs> I went out with this today, and I'm going to try to show you guys just kind of a, like, peek down, so you can actually see that they're close together. Um, uh, yeah, my boobs look awesome, and it's so weird because I can actually now, uh, Ooh, I don't want to cry, but you guys know how hard it <clears throat> no, not crying, not going to cry, how hard it's been for me to actually, like, <clears throat> enjoy life. Like, I, you, I work so hard to lose 135 pounds, and I wanted the 135 pounds gone, lost 135 pounds, got married. Well, then I was self-conscious because my boobs was like a 90-year-old woman's boobs where they sagged down to like my belly, basically, because I was a double D. And, you know, I ended up getting a really bad botched job. Now, I don't want to just like show you guys my boobs on here and flash them. Of course, I know that a lot of you want to see like kind of, I don't know, the guy that did my surgery, I'm wearing the same bra that I normally would wear, but he did such an amazing job that, like, okay, I don't know how to show you, but under my, um, I don't know how to show you, so I said, actually, um, under my arms, basically, my boobs were literally, uh, at my back, and he had to go in. And actually, liposuction, <laughs> yeah, um, under here in order to get all of the, like, stuff and everything that was there from her, she cut, excuse me, way, way, way too far. Oh, oh my gosh, every time. And anyway, today, I went shopping, and I'm not kidding you guys, I spent so much freaking money on, well, okay, I work really hard and I've been saving my money to buy clothes, but I bought so many clothes and I went out, it's, it's, I've been, okay, let's see, today's Saturday, so I'm a week and three days post-op, uh, lateral displacement surgery and another lift, Okay. My incision is almost completely healed up. It does not hurt at all. The only thing that hurts a little bit is I get this burning sensation under here, and I think it's just my nerves coming back to life after the, the you know, incisions that he did. But, oh my gosh, he did such an awesome job. He cut out my old scar, so I, I don't even have a scar there. My boobs are perky, and they stay up, and they're they're amazing. I... I know this sounds horrible, like, and almost conceited, like, but my boobs look freaking awesome. Like, it's, that's what I wanted in the first place. And I can go out and wear a shirt without a bra, and they stay right where they're supposed to stay, and they look good. And the other night, my husband was so excited for me. Like, we went to this, like, wine and cheese t uh, thing for one of his friends or whatever, and it was, like, wine, crackers, and cheese and whatnot, and... Um, I, he asked me if I wanted to go. He didn't really want to go. He was like, ah, I can either take it or leave it. But I'm like, let's go. Because I could not wait to wear this dress that I, that I bought. And it was super tight. And it made my boobs, like, really, like, plumped up. Like, you know, and you could see them. But it looked really, really, really good. And my husband actually turned around and he's like, seriously, babe? He's like, you look so freaking sexy. And he's like... This is, like, seriously, this the hottest I think I've ever seen you look. Like, you look really, really, really good. And then everybody was complimenting me. And then today my mom and I went shopping and I was getting compliments. And it's so awesome. <sighs> Life is great. And I just want to thank all you guys for your support and for trying to help me get through it all. I think my phone's not going to let me upload this if I go any longer. So, 
I will finish this in a second. 